unveiling Edward Bailey's private photos from his youthful affair. Rare photographs believed to have been given by the future King Edward Vi to his married lover have surfaced after over a century hidden from the public eye. These portrait images, dating back to 1919 when the Prince of Wales was just 25 years old, depict him in a casual pose wearing an informal shirt. Historical experts handling the sale of these images speculate that they were gifted to Edward's lover, Frida Dudley Ward, with whom he had a 15-year-long relationship. Their passionate connection is documented through the intimate letters Edward wrote to Frida, expressing desires such as her giving him a hiding and chasing him into bed with a big stick. However, their romance ultimately ended when Frida chose not to leave her husband for the royal suitor, leading Edward to cross paths with American divorcee Wallace Simpson. This pivotal encounter eventually resulted in the 1936 abdication crisis, as Edward relinquished the throne to Mary Wallace. Notably, the photographs are signed on the front with E for Edward, and on the back with David, a name reserved exclusively for family and close friends. These images have resurfaced through the great-granddaughter of Frida's maid, who may have received them from Frida after her relationship with Edward concluded. These rare photographs are estimated to fetch up to 1,500 pounds at auction. Valentina Borgi, an auctioneer at Chiswick Auctions, suggests that the David signature on the photographs implies they were likely given to a very close friend, initially to Frida, and later possibly to her maid after their affair ended. She adds that these photographs might be the only two prints of this particular image that have survived, as no other copies have been found to date. Author Rachel Trethewey, in her 2018 book titled Before Walls, Edward Vaya's Other Women, recounts how Edward and Freda met by chance during a Zeppelin raid in March 1918. Freda sought refuge in the doorway of a grand house in Belgrave Square, London, where the Prince of Wales was attending a party. Edward was immediately captivated by her beauty. Freda, born Winifred Birkin in 1894, had married liberal MP William Dudley Ward on her 19th birthday in 1913, and they had two daughters together. However, by the time she crossed paths with Edward, her marriage was strained. Frida chose to engage in an affair with the future king when her husband was appointed vice-chamberlain to the royal household. The couple often met discreetly at a Windsor farm owned by one of Frida's husband's sisters. When apart, Edward would frequently call her late at night or write passionate letters addressed to my angel, signed with tons and tons of love from your E. In one peculiar letter, he even suggested that she should be cruel to him, believing it would do him worlds of good. Despite his intense feelings for Frida, Edward was involved in other affairs simultaneously. Frida, too, had a passionate affair with banker Michael Herbert. In June 1930, she divorced her husband, but her happiness was short-lived as Michael passed away at the age of 39, leaving her heartbroken. Edward's relationship with Wallace Simpson ultimately brought his connection with Frida to an end. Frida discovered the end of her relationship with Edward when she attempted to call St. James's Palace and was informed by the operator that she was not to be connected. The sale of these rare photographs is scheduled for October 10th. Dear friend, if you like everything new about the royal family and don't want to miss all the novelties, subscribe to our channel and like it. By doing so, you take part in our development. We work for you.